On October 30, 2024, President Volodymyr Zelensky announced a significant advancement in Ukraine's defense capabilities. The country is ramping up the production of Bodana self-propelled howitzers to a rate of up to 20 units per month. This announcement follows Zelensky's recent visit to Nordic countries, where he emphasized the importance of bolstering Ukraine's defense sector amid ongoing conflict. The Bodana, designated 2S-22, is a self-propelled howitzer designed and manufactured entirely in Ukraine. Built on a KRAZ-63226 6x6 truck chassis, it is equipped with a powerful 155mm caliber cannon that can engage targets at distances of up to 42 kilometers using high-explosive incendiary anti-personnel ammunition, and even up to 50 kilometers when utilizing rocket-assisted projectiles. The fact that these howitzers are compatible with NATO standard munitions reflects Ukraine's commitment to aligning its military capabilities with those of its Western allies. This achievement illustrates Ukraine's determination to develop a robust domestic defense industry despite the challenges posed by ongoing military conflict. The Bodana has been designed with mobility and battlefield adaptability in mind, showcasing innovative engineering that draws inspiration from established systems like the French Caesar and Israeli Atmos wheeled howitzers. The vehicle features an armored cabin at the front and an artillery system mounted at the rear, enhancing both protection and operational effectiveness. Equipped with a modern targeting and fire control system, the 2S-22 Bodana incorporates a ballistic computer, a computerized fire control unit, an automatic gun-laying system, and a navigation module. This advanced technology allows for quick positioning and precise targeting, critical in fast-paced combat scenarios. With a crew of five, the Bodana boasts impressive mobility, traversing both paved roads and rough terrains at a top speed of 80 km per hour and a range of up to 1,000 km. It is capable of overcoming various obstacles, including vertical challenges of 0.7 meters, trenches of 1 meter, and gradients of 60%, while also fording water up to a depth of 1.2 meters. Denmark has been instrumental in enhancing Ukraine's military capacity by funding the production of 18 Bodana units, which were delivered to Ukraine's armed forces as of September 2024. This partnership marks a significant milestone as Denmark becomes the first EU country to specifically allocate funds for procuring Ukrainian-made military equipment, reinforcing the European Union's commitment to supporting Ukraine's defense efforts. On September 29, 2024, Denmark and Ukraine further solidified their collaboration with a substantial $600 million defense investment agreement. The production of Bodana self-propelled howitzers at this scale is a remarkable feat, especially for a nation engaged in active conflict. Only a handful of countries worldwide possess the capacity to manufacture artillery systems in such volumes, highlighting Ukraine's achievements under military pressure. This production not only meets the operational demands of the Ukrainian armed forces, but also addresses the requirements of allied nations seeking reliable and effective weaponry supplies. This development represents a pivotal shift for Ukraine's defense industry, transitioning from a reliance on imported military equipment to establishing a solid industrial base capable of producing advanced systems domestically. The collaboration and support from international partners, particularly Denmark, have significantly amplified Ukraine's production capabilities, enhancing its deterrence potential in the face of Russian aggression. In April 2024, Zelensky had already announced that Ukraine's defense industry produced 10 Bodanas in a single month. With the current pace reaching a maximum of 20 units per month, the sustained production of Bodanas has become a cornerstone of Ukraine's defense strategy. By integrating international support into its production efforts, Ukraine not only strengthens its capacity to sustain ongoing military operations but also prepares for future challenges, reinforcing its resilience against external threats. In conclusion, Ukraine's commitment to advancing its defense production exemplifies the nation's resolve to fortify its military capabilities and sovereignty marking a significant step toward greater self-reliance and operational effectiveness on the battlefield.